Live Oak Point is a beautiful park on the shore of Charlotte Harbor. It's located on the northeast side of the double US-41 bridges. The park completes phase 1A of the Charlotte Harbor Gateway Project and was officially opened in June 2016, but it was in the planning stage for a long time. County Commissioner Stephen R. Deutsch joked about the length of the process during his remarks to the crowd who gathered to celebrate the park during the ribbon cutting ceremony. It seems like uh, this project was on the drawing board and dreamed of a, a long time ago. Uh, as I recall, I was tall, slender, and clean shaven. I honestly think this has been in the works for about 10 years. Kelly Slaughter is the county engineer who oversaw the construction of the park. While planning and lining up the money to build the park was a multi-year process, the actual construction lasted just over a year. The Charlotte Harbor Community Redevelopment Agency, or CRA for short, was the driving force behind the project. Redevelopment manager Deborah Forrester worked on the project since the beginning stages. It started with the Charlotte Harbor CRA and using their tax increment dollars to do the design work. So that started the process and of course the Board of County Commissioners approved us moving forward in that direction. Once the design was completed, the Charlotte Harbor CRA had to find ways to fund the project. They applied for and received money from the Florida Department of Transportation, which was a five-year process. In that five years, there was a lot of changes that took place. When we got the funds, the recession was over, construction dollars were going up, and um, that had caused to some um, increase in the budget amount. We were also looking at the West Coast Inland Navigational District and Boater Improvement Funds. They assisted greatly in helping us fill some of that funding gap and then the Board of County Commissioners also finished out that funding gap. The CRA has been very fierce on what they wanted for their uh, projects and this is their very first one and I'm glad that it's finally realized. Live Oak Point costs $2.1 million and features beautiful landscaping including 26 live oak trees, shaded seating areas, parking, restrooms, accent lighting, and a sidewalk along the shore of the Peace River. Future phases of the park include a fishing pier and Phase 1B, scheduled for construction during the 2016-2017 fiscal year, includes a boardwalk that will connect pedestrians to the west side of US-41. We would really like to be able to provide a safe access between the east side and the west side of US-41, and because of the limited ability we have doing it at grade at US-41, we had a look at doing something underneath the bridge. And because the bridge height is also an issue, that's what led us to the boardwalk underneath. Forrester says the Charlotte Harbor CRA already has money set aside for phase two of the Charlotte Harbor Gateway project. She says when completed, Live Oak Point will be the gateway that connects multiple parks via a safe pedestrian connection. I think that will only add to the enhancement of this particular site and really create that same synergy that they have in downtown Punta Gorda. When you look at Lashley Park and what they have there, our goal is to have that mirrored image over here so you can go from downtown Punta Gorda to Charlotte Harbor and have retail uh, restaurants, you know, to visit and enjoy this beautiful vista. Phase two of the Charlotte Harbor Gateway is scheduled for completion by 2019. Reporting for CCTV, I'm Todd Dunn.